Welcome back to One Comic Book a Day as we finish off Superman number 27 with Dear Diary. But the final story, Dear Diary, is a fun little gimmick that's basically just a prankster story lacking the prankster. The story is told through three different people's diary entries. Lois being kind of like more the main character or more of the main story. Uh, Rockwell being the person who needs to be helped and Goldie who is the criminal. Goldie has convinced millionaire Rockwell to invest with him, doubling his money. He never explains how he's doubling the money. He's just doubling the money. And once the money is actually doubled, Rockwell doesn't really care about how he goes about it. He just cares about the results. We find out how Goldie is doing that through Lois Lane's portion, where Goldie is actually robbing Rockwell's jewelry stores and using the profit from that to double the money. So he's actually stealing from him to pay him back more. That's actually quite clever, though it's not going to work for very long. But I respect the pluck. Of course, once Superman gets involved in this, this is going to all fall apart. And yeah, it all falls apart. They do try to trick us by having Goldie's entries not be in, say, prison until the very final entry reveals he is in prison. Just the other en uh, entries were not in prison. So yeah, I don't really see the point of it. It was sort of fun to change up the format for an issue. Uh, but other than that, not particularly strong. And once again, it's just a prankster story without the prankster. Guess that might actually be better. All right, that is it from Superman number 27, Dear Diary. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Hit the bell icon to get notifications when a new video goes up. I do this Monday through Friday, but Fridays is that Friday where I cover a Batman story and how to detect comics with Batman. And whatever did happen to the man of tomorrow? And does Superman not carry a diary? He feels like someone who likes to journal. Okay, have a great day.